Breaking tonight, a massive manhunt underway for the driver behind the horrific Barcelona terror attack. 14 people in total are dead and more than 100 injured across three separate attacks that Spanish police say are all connected. Sadly, tonight we are learning that 42-year-old Jared Tucker from California is among those killed in this senseless act. Foreign Affairs correspondent Benjamin Hall is live in Barcelona with the frantic search to bring terrorists to justice. Benjamin? Uh, good evening, Sandra. Well, it was here on this street, Las Ramblas, where this all began yesterday. 5 p.m., that white van careering down the road through the pedestrians behind me. And as you say, 13 were killed on that occasion, including a three-year-old boy and also that American, Jared Tucker, 42 years old. His father spoke to the press today about the moment they found out that he was dead. They showed him some pictures of some of the people that had, were killed during the attack and they recognize one of the pictures as Jared. Eight hours after that uh, initial attack, another attack in a beachside town 62 miles south of here called Kabil. In that occasion, five terrorists wearing fake suicide bomb belts attacked and ran their car into pedestrians and police. They were all killed, four by the same policewoman, and among them was the driver of the white van. But nevertheless, police believe that this was a wide set of at least nine jihadis, and they fear that there may be more out there. But Barcelona very much trying to come together today. And it was only 24 hours till Las Ramblas was open again. And there was a minute of silence today with the Prime Minister Rajoy and the King of Spain, Felipe VI. So Barcelona trying to get back, trying to get back to normal. Nevertheless, that worry that there may be more members of this cell still out there. Sharon. All right. Thank you, Benjamin.